I am Patrick Dixon. Um, I'm Jonathan Henning. This is Dustin Dotson. He will be our guest star for our video today. Um, today we are going to be showing you how to take care of injuries. Injuries such as nosebleed, animal bites, objects in the eye, concussions, and being unconscious. Is that a wasp over there? Got it! Do this! Yeah! So, Dustin, I've got a new idea for how we do the and how that. Basically, I thought that we can um, have, like, Patrick try to run, trip over one of the roots out in the backyard. Ow! What the heck? And get a guy, dude! What the heck? I, I was running and one of your paths, like, passing me, and I ran to a wall. You don't remember whatever we see? A cat. A cat, really? Okay. Okay. <laughs> Makes sense. Oh, my God! I need a doctor. Call me a doctor. I need Down gently. Got it. Steady. You will. Yeah. So how are we gonna do this? I got it. Okay. Ow! <laughs> oh my God! You got blood on me. Ew, ew. <laughs> oh! Now it's a very incorrect thing you should have done there, Dusty, for removing an object as large as a pencil off someone's eye. You shouldn't. Just call 911 and have them remove the eyeball using an extensive surgery. Now, for animal bites, you can see we couldn't really get any of the animals to actually bite us. So here's an actual picture of someone being bitten by a snake. Gruesome, huh? Yeah, not really. It's actually pretty funny. But anyway, in order to fix a snake bite, you must... 1. Wash the bite with soap and water as soon as possible. You want to remove as much of the snake's spit as you can. 2. Keep the bitten area below the heart. This is done to slow the flow of the venom. 3. Take off any rings or watches. The venom is going to make you swell and jewelry might cut off your circulation. 4. Tightly wrap a bandage 2 to 4 inches above the bite. If you can't reach medical care within 30 minutes, wrap a bandage around the bitten appendage. This is to assist in reducing the flow of venom. You might want to make it tight, but not too tight, because it will completely cut off the appendage's circulation. That will only cause tissue damage. 5. This is optional, but if you have a snake bite kit, place the suction device over the bite to help draw the venom out of the wound. Leave on for a maximum of 10 minutes. If used properly, a suction device can remove up to 30% of the venom. Now, I don't know anyone that actually has a snake bite kit, so my number 5 would be get medical attention immediately. I hate you so much! You see what he did to me right there? Okay? Dude! Oh. 
Sean. Tired? <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! Oh no, he's dead. OMG! Oh my gosh! He's, he's dead. dead! No, I think it's just us. He's unconscious. Probably because of his, um. I was about to say seizure, but I mean. That's not what you're supposed to do for a concussion. <laughs> <laughs> So yeah. Doesn't have good fall. Hmm. Oh, hit a rock. I noticed. Hey, he's alright. He's not. Right there. <laughs> I didn't do so. <laughs> 